All you need to know about your tinnitus diagnosis. Tinnitus, or the sensation of ringing or humming noises in the ear, can be distracting and distressing. It commonly occurs in older persons and is often accompanied by hearing loss. There are many causes and possible treatments for this condition, so getting a correct diagnosis is important. This article will offer some tips about dealing with tinnitus. Remain calm. Tinnitus is only rarely a symptom of a serious brain condition or hearing problem. You don't need to stress about suddenly having developed a brain tumor or puncturing an eardrum. Generally, tinnitus is a condition all on its own, without an underlying medical explanation that could lead to other problems. Seek advice from a doctor if you are suffering from tinnitus. Tinnitus is likely a sign of a different problem that will likely need treatment from a professional. Chronic tinnitus can also be stressful and make it hard to enjoy a normal day. Tinnitus is unlikely to be deadly, but the benefit of seeing a doctor is that it may be treatable. Research the various natural remedies for tinnitus. There are many means that people were able to successfully treat tinnitus for centuries without the use of medication. Be sure to talk with your physician before trying something, as some herbs can interact with medication, and some of the options available may not be healthy for you. You may want looking into having acupuncture done if you suffer from tinnitus. Acupuncture helps to relax your body, thus, reducing your symptoms. Another technique that relaxes both your mind and your body is a massage. Both of these techniques should be spoken about with your doctor before trying them. If tinnitus causes you problems when you're trying to fall asleep, consider relaxation techniques. Meditation, deep breathing, and even yoga can help you to get your body completely relaxed so you can overcome the noise in your ears. I personally like to use deep breathing, because it helps me both forget the sound and also keeps my blood pressure low. Avoiding caffeine at bedtime is an excellent strategy to employ if you're having trouble falling asleep due to tinnitus symptoms. To begin with, a caffeine allergy can actually cause tinnitus symptoms in healthy individuals, but it will also keep you awake and consciously focused on your tinnitus symptoms at bedtime. Use a properly fitted medical device to help relieve tinnitus. A hearing aid alleviates symptoms in about half of tinnitus patients who also have hearing loss. A tinnitus masker, a device worn in the ear which produces a low-level noise that helps cover the unpleasant ringing sensation, can also benefit patients without hearing loss. Tinnitus retraining therapy, or TRT, is very efficient. This therapy is designed for those with tinnitus, and to make their life more comfortable. The thinking involves not thinking or dealing with tinnitus more than other things in your life, like clothes. If you have been unable to find a treatment that eliminates your tinnitus symptoms, try tinnitus retraining therapy. Tinnitus is a common condition which is usually not dangerous. But proper diagnosis is necessary to rule out potentially serious causes and map out a course of treatment. Even though tinnitus is often uncomfortable, steps can be taken to help manage it. The tips in the above article should help increase your understanding of this condition.